We'll use up the rest of the flowers. And boom. Perfect. That's much better. I like how the, the spruce wood door looks with the spruce wood leaves. I think it it's good. Um, now let's finish off this path. We can have the... Oh, I fell in a hole. <laughs> we can kind of have this path sort of die out just by doing that. And we can bring the cobblestone over here and possibly kind of mix it in. Let's see. Cobblestone, cobblestone, cobblestone. There it is. We can just kind of make it look like it's sort of mixing in with this path by doing that. Oh, not my intention. We'll just put it there. There we go. That's kind of nice. I just make the little transition from the this path to my little path. Whoops. No! <laughs> Okay, that's better. It makes it like a nicer transition from this path to my little path here. And I think that looks a little bit better. Okay. Um, none of those have grown, unfortunately. Why don't we finish off this path? I know it's a lot of path building and stuff, but I want it to, to look nice and complete. And complete. Um, let's see, what should we get? We could use... um. The rest of these stone bricks. I'm not sure if I'm gonna have enough though, but we might as well try it out. See how it looks, kind of like this, or I guess not there. But I was thinking just bringing it around the side, kind of like this, to make it look like we have a bit of a wall holding up the path instead of it just being raised. <laughs> okay, like so. Actually, we should stop it right there. Okay. That's better, I think. Now it kind of looks like there's holding... There's something holding up the path here. Instead of it just dropping off like a cliff. <laughs> and we might even want to terraform this, but we'll do that later. And there we go. That ju that'll just add to the look of the place a lot, I think. Instead of just having it being like really gross and awful looking. This area still looks gross and awful, but this area is nicer. I actually really like this farm being here. So that's nice. Um, what should we do next though? Why don't we... Why don't we... Why don't we... We should probably start making some animal pens so I don't have to rely on bread for food. So let's make some fences here. Um, I'm almost out of oak wood again. And fences tend to be quite expensive. Okay. Boom. Boom. Has the new fence thing been been added? Yes, it has. That that update, I think it was 1.8, that made fences into a like different colors made fences so incredibly expensive. Is that it? Oh yeah it is. Look at that's so expensive and you still get the same amount of fences. Like gosh. <laughs> it's a lot. Do this. We'll just make all of them. I'm not sure if I'll have enough to actually make... I, I don't think I'm going to have enough to make an actual pen. But we'll get it started. Oh, it's a baby cow! Hi, hi, hi. Stay here. Hello. Hello. We'll make the pen right here. And you can do like this around the baby cow. Hello. I'm just going to trap... Oh, no! No, no, no. Stay, stay, stay in there. Stay. Don't fall over the edge, but stay... Stay in this lovely place that I built for you. Cow! No! Shoot. Well, this is kind of the trap that the villager did, so I can just push animals into here. And I might want to add a little fence gate. And we can continue our path over in that direction, too. Darn, I'm disappointed in that cow then go into the pen. Ah. <laughs> Darn cow. That was really cute, though. I like baby cows. Okay fence gate to finish it off so I can actually get in. I'm surprised I had enough, um, I had enough things. I had enough fences for this. Okay, and let's just move this flower over a little bit and we can continue our path into here. And there we are. Perfect. Oh, hey, he's back up. Hmm. 
Should I make a little dirt? Oh, he's down again. <laughs> no! Cow, you're gonna get so much fall damage. Oh, yes, come up here. Come up here. Come up here, little friend. You got it. No, don't fall in again. Don't. We don't want that. I just want you to go right on in there. But it, no, right into the into the pen. And now, oh, <laughs> cow. Okay, go in. You're so difficult to push into the right place. Stop walking. Stop. Stop walking. Why won't you stop walking? <laughs> okay, there. Nope. Nope. Oh goodness gracious. This guy is a little troublemaker. He just doesn't want to go into the pen. And I guess I don't blame him. I don't think I would want to live in a pen either. But, you know, I just... I want you to... I want you to be a part of my life, cow! Come on. Hey, do I have wheat? I, I do have wheat. But let's use that on him. Hey. Hey, you. Hey, pal. Hey. Hey. There you go. There you go. Let's come in here. Yay! Perfect. We have a cow. I forgot. It. Somehow I forgot about that trick. It's been so long since I've used it. Probably because leads are are all new and stuff, and everyone uses leads. But I guess I haven't needed cows in a while. Okay. Do I have a saddle? I don't have a saddle. That's disappointing. I do have lots of horse armor, though. I should organize these chests a little bit more. Let's just at least keep the horse armors together so I actually know where they are. Okay. Okay. There, there we go. There we go. I feel like this is one of those games where I have to, like, slide the pieces and make them all fit together. Because I only, I only have two open slots. And that's kind of similar to those games. Okay. We have a cow. We have a sugarcane farm that's grown a sugarcane. Yay! One has grown. Woo. One more. Okay, I want this thing to be full when I'm done with it. <laughs> oh, it's getting dark. These sunsets are so pretty. I want to take a screenshot. Does that take? Are you able to take a screenshot? I guess I just have to print screen. And go away, screenshot saved. Go away, go away. Screenshot. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> All right, now we can sleep. Now on to the next project. I might actually want to get some cows before I move on to the next project. We, we should do that. We should get more cows. Um, I saw some cows over there, but it, it may have killed them. And there's a river in the way. I should make a bridge across this river. Let's, you know, that's that'll be our next project. We can make a bridge right, oh, gosh, where should we make the bridge? Let's make it here, I guess. We will make a bridge. Um, out of spruce wood, I guess? We can use spruce wood for the bridge. I'm running out of resources. I need to, like, just spend some time getting more more resources here. But let's use this, this spruce wood and we can make a, a lovely little footbridge to get things across. We'll make it three wide, okay? We can use that. And we have to use the ultimate bridge technique. We're just going to have to make all that. <laughs> um, we can use the ultimate bridge technique of stairs. Half slabs. Two half slabs. Half slabs. I, there's a, there is a technique. I forget what it is exactly. But we need more stairs. Let's see. Take half a stack. And then half of a half of a stack. Will that be enough? Let's see. I think that'll be enough. Okay. Now we can make our bridge. We just need to to flatten this out. Actually, the bridge should probably right here be right here, extending from the path. But that's not exactly a straight shot, is it? Hmm. Let's fill this in a little bit just to make it a little bit easier on ourselves to, to actually make the bridge. Then we can continue the path from here. Let's see. Like this. And then down one. We're just going to do the same kind of path as what I did over there for the stairs with the half slabs and stuff. Oh, hey, wow, that cow grew really quickly. <laughs> I just put him in there. <laughs> wow, that did not take the five minutes that I was expecting. Hmm. Okay. Well, I guess I'm, I'm happy about that. <laughs> it just didn't take him long. <laughs> or her, I guess, because it is a cow. 
All right. We're gonna have to use up our half slabs on this. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay. And we'll add the stone bricks in later. And our bridge will be right here. So we can start it like right there. Or what we could do, we could start it with stairs and then gradually, that's the technique, we start it with stairs and we gradually make it into half slabs and then other stuff like more half slabs. <laughs> okay, we'll make two stairs, then one half slab, like that, and then we'll do another half slab after that, I think. This is good bridge building technique, I think. Hopefully it won't look like super weird and high, but I think that's, that's good. Okay, and then the next thing, well actually, let's do one more half slab, single half slab, just to really round it off there. And we'll do two half slabs this will be our pattern for the other side as well. So we'll do one there and then bring it out another right on this level. There we go. Let's just take a look. See how that is. That looks pretty good. That's pretty round. And then we might have to add some support beams just to, you know, give it that needed support in Minecraft. <laughs> Minecraft bridges need support beams still. They don't want to feel left out from normal real life bridges. Okay, there we go. And then we'll do three. Whoops, that was not my intention. I'm gonna run out of half slabs here, unfortunately. I kind of expected that though. <laughs> this is gonna be a pretty big bridge. And we're gonna have to make it all the way over to the other side. I never added the path blocks here. I should do that. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. That's better. <laughs> I had to do that. And we're doing three here. So one, two, three. Let's set down a crafting table over here so I don't have to run all the way back over to the house to craft up something. And we'll make some more half slabs out of these. It still might not be enough. I feel like that's what I had to start with. <laughs> it was about 43. Okay, should we do another three? Why don't we start building the other side? Um, that way we can just kind of meet it in the middle. Let's see, where is it? It's right here. So we can make it start right here. Then I need to set down another crafting table <laughs> so I can make more stairs. Okay, perfect. One, two, three. And then we're just gonna follow the same pattern, I guess, right here as the other side. Okay, where did my half slabs go? There they are. <laughs> I put them away for some reason. Okay, let's see. We did three ones, then two twos, then a three. And then we'll figure it out from there. <laughs> This is like circle building. It's very tedious and takes lots of focus and not messing stuff up and thinking. <laughs> Did I already say thinking? I don't know. Okay, that's that's two. And we have one more. Let's not mess this up. It's too early in the game to mess this up. Okay. Then we have two. You take it out. Oh, shoot. <laughs> We got one, then two, and we do that again, one more time. That's one, and then two. Bridge construction is, is very tedious. It's um one of the more boring parts of the game, but it is a very necessary part to get across those rivers, those darn rivers. Okay. Okay, that was our that was our two. So this is a three. And then once I get finished with this three, we we might just go all the way across from there. I think that'll be good. <laughs> okay, let's 
that and then we're just gonna take the rest of this all the way across to the other side I'm gonna have to make more eh. <laughs> I'm gonna have to make more half slabs that was a weird sound like my tongue got caught somewhere I got big I can't I can't I can't make that sound again <laughs> I don't know I don't know how I made that sound okay shoot we're out of slabs again I think this is a nice curve I feel like this looks like a cliff compared to the, the half slabs. Hmm. Then we'll add some railings and stuff just to make it look a lot nicer. And we'll be good. Okay. This half slabs make stairs look so steep. That's weird. Okay. I don't think I messed anything up, so that's good. Alrighty. Perfect. We have the framework frameworks of a bridge lovely okay now we just have to add our railings and stuff and some support beams and all that fancy stuff and we'll be good so what should we do for the railings we could do oak wood I don't want to use spruce wood for the railings also um, we could use stone um, what else could we do we could we could try using like half slabs or, or not half slabs um what if we tried using trap doors how would that look that might be kind of interesting if they can can they be on the stairs yes they can that's kind of actually that's kind of interesting looking let me make a little bit more um trap doors and see how that looks make one two three and I'm like completely out of wood. So, <laughs> whoops. It's gonna look kind of funny like that though, but we might be able to work with it. That's not terrible looking by any means. That's actually pretty good. Hmm. What could we like add to it to make it look better? Can we add fences, possibly? Those are two expensive things <laughs> that I just made there. <laughs> fences and trap doors. Both quite the expensive thing. Oh, that's weird looking. That's weird looking. Never mind. We're not doing fences. Um, we could do fences for the support, though. I don't know. We'll see. I might just use logs. But I will be needing to collect a little bit more wood before we do that and it's raining and it might be getting dark it is getting dark again I feel like it gets dark so quickly so quickly <laughs> nope. our path is looking good though I'm quite happy with it maybe we could use stone bricks instead of um instead of trap doors I'm I'm afraid it's gonna it's gonna look kind of ugly and it's gonna be expensive with all the wood I'm gonna need for it so we might just use stone bricks instead or we could go with cobble Hmm. Or we could use the logs. The logs might look better. I feel like the logs could definitely look better. Especially if we mixed in some oak wood with the, the spruce wood. Okay. It, it has been determined that we are using oak wood logs as our railings. And I will... I guess I'll use the trap doors for something. Like, eventually. Although I'm not sure what. Maybe if I decide to build, like, a, a mob trap, I'll use the trap doors. Possibly. But who knows? Okay. Red. And is there a cow over there? Or is that? Oh, that's a wolf killing a sheep. Okay. That's what I was talking about with a wolf killing stuff. Okay. <laughs> Let's go get some more oak wood. Just a little bit. I'm going to need another axe soon, too. I like how I'm not actually using the bridge that I just built. I just decided to swim under the water. That's. Yay! Utilizing stuff I built. <laughs> okay. Let's get rid of this, because I won't be needing it anymore. That's a nice shape. I like that. I'm pretty happy with that. Um, let's go get that axe. I, ooh, look at the sugar cane. It's, it's growing! Yay! Alright. Let's get some iron. I have actually a decent amount of iron. Three. All that caving paid off for once. Except for in the diamond department. I, I still only have, like, what, four diamonds? two diamonds right now and get, wait why did I just make a bit well we have a pick a backup pickaxe now <laughs> whoops I do that so often 
I do that so often. Just making a pickaxe instead of an axe. Or an axe instead of a pickaxe. You'd think I wouldn't do that for the amount of time that I've been playing this game. But I do. I definitely do. Okay, let's get like a stack of oak wood. And then I'll be, back. I'll be right back. I won't make you watch me chop down wood. <laughs> 